just to tell you a little about the idea behind this series, I'm reimagining or recreating different artworks from different time periods and from different artists. So that then is the literal kind of translation of seeing something through tinted glasses. I usually work in series, so this series I'm exhibiting here today, Tinted Glasses, is my sixth series. But for me it's been mostly consistency. I've never practiced another style of art, um, and I've never really been interested in practicing any other style. So, just naturally, the way, the more you do something, the better you get at it. I've gradually gotten better and better at creating these kinds of paintings. The style is constant, but I try to figure out ways to make it look more and more interesting and to make it challenging for me as an artist. So even the reason why I've selected these eight artworks to display here is because each of them has a, like, has a different thing about it. So every painting has its own kind of thing that made it technically difficult. And um, challenging myself like that has also helped me to, to grow in this style and get to this level. I like how I felt when I first saw the art, I felt like there is something beyond, this is a regular, I love um, the pieces he did, I love the color palettes and the emotion that it invoked when I first saw the work. Yeah. My favorite artwork is the blurry Gertrude, uh, the one behind me, so yeah, and I've had a good time. I can say the artist is doing great work. Is also is is showing that people in Nairobi or the community here in Kenya, yeah. like they can see art at another, another level. Yeah. Realism art is not so common in Kenya, yeah. so it's a it's a new thing, yeah. uh, and it's, a, it's an evoking experience yeah. for the collectors and the art lovers.